here we are at Kingsway Boxing. My name is Gary Marter, and we're going to go over conditioning drills that a fighter needs to do. We start off every workout jumping rope. It helps develop your footwork, it gives you agility, it, it gets your body pumping. It's one of the best warm-up exercises that I know of. Here we have Jack doing pull-ups, looking for strength to develop the upper body with wide grip. Next exercise you see him doing chin-ups. Chin-ups is very good exercise for developing your biceps. And now you see Jack doing his dips. Dips are instrumental for increasing strength for your uh, triceps, which give you the ability for speed and power. Now we have Jack doing sit-ups. We're doing it with a medicine ball. Jack is extending his hands over his head each time he comes down. This will stretch the muscles at the same time you're crunching. Now we have Jack doing his jumping drills. Dealing with his right hand and his left hand. Now you see him doing it with both hands. Now what we have Jack doing is his defensive drills in the mirror. Teaches him to weave, bob, teaches him to uh, move his shoulders, work combinations, move your head, throw your punches off of the head movement. We did a pad work drill showing a jab and a right hand. More importantly, what I wanted him to do is I wanted him to get in with the ability to get out. You have to get in to hit the guy. After you hit the man, he's going to look to hit you back. You have to move. You can't be there anymore. Then you come in again, and then you move. This drill, te this drill teaches Jack not to get hit. The pad work we're doing now is showing combinations. What we do is we go over basic footwork, basic punching combinations. We try to incorporate speed and power in our technique. Fighters must hit. They must hit, they must move, they must feel a solid object in front of them. Heavy bag is phenomenal for this. When a fighter hits the heavy bag, he's feeling the weight of that bag. It's like hitting another person. It's, it, it's almost simulating the fight. Heavy bag is great for developing footwork. It teaches you to move around the bag. It teaches you to incorporate the offense, the defensive technique, and the footwork that you've learned. Speed bag is an amazing device. It teaches a person to move his hands quickly because the bag moves. The faster you hit it, the harder you hit it, the faster the bag moves, the more you have to stay on top. It's a rhythm drill. It te teaches you to keep your hands moving. Now we have the double end bag. Some call it the California bag. This teaches a person to hit a moving target. This double end bag does not stay still like the heavy bag nor the speed bag. It tends to move on its own in a crazy willy manner. You have to chase it. You have to be there. You have to hit the bag when it comes in your range. You have to watch it, hit it. Watch it, hit it. Always be there. It's a phenomenal timing drill. You come to Kingsway, you're going to be trained as a professional fighter.